My name is Tokwe Oshinyogun and I'm a director producer um, for the purpose of Nollywood Week Paris. I am the director of Journey to Self. And Toby, what is the story of Journey to Self? Uh, Journey to Self is, um, basically chronicles the journey to self-discovery of four women who come together um, at the event of the death of their very close friend who they all went to school together and she left them a series of letters um, while they stay in her house um, counting down to her burial and in this series of letters she reveals um, how much she really knows about what each one of them is going through and reveals a lot about what she went through that led to her death as well and this kind of bonds them all together you know um, afresh and then helps them tackle their personal demons and then overcome them at the end. And the film is out on general release or is it just in the festival? Um, right now it's not out on DVD yet but it's been seen in the cinemas and um, it's online um, on online sites but not on DVD yet and also still in festivals. Okay and um, you're a woman director in Nigeria. That's that's quite unusual. <laughs> I get that I mean, all the time. We were talking time. earlier to Michelle Bello, but I, th 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 there's not many of them for the pound. No, they're not. They're not many of us. And so, how is it to be a, a woman um, director in Nigeria? At the beginning of my career, it, it did seem like, you know, um, a little bit of a huge task because you'd always get the look, you know, when you got on set and your crew, you know, know that you're a woman. There's the initial reluctance, you know, to take orders from you. And, but basically it's founded on the fact that they're not sure if you know what you're doing or they're not sure why you're there or not, you know. So I got that at the beginning of my career, which I started on television, directing soap opera. And after doing that for a while, you know, then they got to know, okay, this person knows what she's doing, you know. <laughs> she's, it's not about being a woman or man or whatever. She knows what she's doing and let's get to the job, you know, and that's it. So, I mean, so what I get... what TV soap operas did you do? Um, I shot Tinsel. Tinsel is um, really big in Africa. Um, I shot that for five years, um, about 350 episodes altogether. And I just um, stopped doing that last year um, to get on to doing films and other other projects. And so what's coming up next for you? Um, actually, immediately another soap and then another film. And the soap is for who and what's, what's that? The about? soap is a personal project. Um, it's set against the backdrop of the music industry. Um, Tinsel was set against the backdrop of the film industry, but um, this is a little bit more different. It's like a hybrid um, of the, the quintessential soapy and the uh, edgy drama series kind of thing. So, so what's the name of that? Um, it's called Rush. Okay. Yeah. And who, is, who are you doing Rush with? Um, actually, my husband. Um, yeah. He's the creator of, of Rush. He writes as well, and yeah. I'm directing it as well, and I'm co-producing. And so what's the film? Well, um, <laughs> that um, is not a personal project. It's something um, um, a client has asked me to, you know, do for them, which we're right now talking about. We haven't yet gotten into pre-production as it is, because the script is still being written, but um, we're in talks and it, it's a project that will be done um, later this year or early next year.